to what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's a 4-3-3. Well, a system promoted by the rise of total football, Peter. The wider players in the front three are, are key operators in how it all works on and off the ball. They have to provide for the central striker, of course, and protect their fullback, so they'll get few breathers. If these two don't make a good impression, there are quite good replacements on the bench. There's the whistle, and here we go. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Mohamed Salah. And it's mainly because of his frightening pace. He's a huge threat when he's running at defenders, but he's also proved in recent times that he's a top-class finisher. Opposition defences are going to have to be wary about playing a high line because there's nothing this guy relishes more than space to run into. And once he gets there, he's gone. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. Andreas Pereira. Now it's William. And that's going to be a goal kick. Alexander Arnold. Well, Peter, look how far up the fullbacks are getting now. This is really high. And constantly after the ball, aren't they? Yeah, I think they're they're weighing up their options to see how long they can sustain this and, and suppress those wide opposition players. That's great strength on the ball. Crunching tackle. Well, he had a really good run at goal there, but the defence just weren't going to let him past. Reed, Reed. Well, it's very much the start we expected. There is a sizable gulf in quality between the two sides. Now it's Diogo Jota. That's an untidy challenge, free kick given. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. it out of harm's way and he has been fouled there he's having a go oh crossbar Diop knocks him, he's going for goal! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. Well, that's confidence for you, distance doesn't even bother him. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Pinned towards the front line. Gravenberg. Oh, good. He's had a shot. Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Yogo Jota certainly could have and should have made more of that. Robertson gets across to intercept that. Tete cuts out the pass. Reed. 
Thiago with the foul. Andreas Pereira. Excellent challenge there, uncompromising. Oh, he's enjoyed that. He evidently loves the contest. Alexander Arnold. The press is doing its job and possession has been lost. Ravenberg. And they've switched it over to the other side. Alexander Arnold. Ravenberg. A oh, good and the shot! Great build up. It all deserved a better ending. Oh, it's a real opportunity missed there. He's done all the hard work getting to the ball, and all he needed to do was get some control on it. Tete. Now Reed. Played out wide into space. And the first 45 minutes are up. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Yeah, and despite the scoreline, it's clear who the better side is when it comes to chances. If this is the trend that's going to continue, then there's only going to be one winner here. And uh, I don't think it's going to take too much improvement for it to happen. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. And we are already promptly back on the way. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce something a little more magical. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's got to be a change. And now they can spring out of defence. And that's a throw-in. Van Dijk. And it's Thiago. Gravenberg. And it's Thiago. Sends it forward. It's an inviting looking ball that. Tete. Carlos Vinicius. He knows it's taken a big and very kind deflection, but he is claiming it nonetheless. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. Van Dijk. Oh, can he get onto this? And here's Mohamed Salah. Oh, he's picked out the runner. The fullback is in acres of space here. Up to meet it! Good delivery, but no joy. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out. Bravo, 
Reed. Carlos Vinicius. Reed. Played out towards the right wing. Good spot. He's seen the run. It's run loose here. Thiago. Your impression so far, Jim? There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. Tete has created one goal already. Reed. Robust defending and the ball's been lost. Van Dijk defending his corner stubbornly, stood up very well to his man. Moved on forwards. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Tries to dink it in. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Andreas Pereira. Now it's Carlos Vinicius. William. And that's been lever clear. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed. But will they? Being intercepted, and that will come to nothing. I think we're about to see a frenetic finish. Uh, no half measures from here. William. Williams cross. Has a goal! It's in! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. Sharp, simple, satisfying. He just knew what was on. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Two up and very little time left, surely this is it. Well, that's a really bitter blow. I think it's going to be very hard for them to find the character to respond from that. And there goes the final whistle.